What's going on guys? Welcome to my playthrough of Project Zomboy. Uh, so we're gonna try something different today. Um, we're gonna do a long format as usual, but in this case we're trying to survive for as long as possible. This is an apocalypse version of the game, I guess. Um, or game mode. And we're gonna start with a character named... What's your name, buddy? Paul Bennett. <laughs> we're a burger flipper app um, from the modern world. And we spawned here. Do we have a map? We do have a map. Jeez Louise, okay. So, welcome to my... Uh, Apocalypse Diaries. So every, I guess, episode will be equivalent to, I guess, a couple of days or two from from uh, from Project Zomboid in Project Zomboid. So the style of this is just going to be keep it rolling until we die. Oh, we got some fresh food and tomato paste. We got some canned tuna. Where's this coming from? This TV. Oh, it's over here. I'm gonna lower that volume over there. Right on. Okay, so... So far... Electricity is still here. I'm not sure... How... Bad... Oh, foraging level 2. Look at that. Tailor tailoring as well. I think we got lucky here. I think we're gonna get the foraging. Start reading it sometime later. But our first order of business is to kind of some somehow find a uh, backpack, denim shirt, leather jacket. I'm gonna wear the leather jacket. We just literally, as you can see, we literally just just had had just came on from uh from work here we even have the burger flipper hat I hear zombies dude I hear them walking oh we're kind of short-sighted too which is why we have glasses on farming volume 3 carpentry volume 4 magazines and a bunch of other stuff which is nice. Tweezers, soap, bath towel, uh, sheet. Guess I'm grabbing this. Grab a sheet as well. Toothbrush, toothpaste. Hmm. Okay. Let's. Uh, do we want to shut off all the lights? <laughs> you can just click on it. That's kind of nice. Once we get a hammer, we can start dis disassembling these stuff. But uh, for now, I say we just roll it the way it is. Oh, look at this now. Two zombies just across the yard. I'm close to curtains. Is this my room? Or is this my child's room? Do we, uh, are we... Do we have a family? What do we know about ourselves? Okay, we can turn on, turn off the lights there. Turn off the lights here. Trying to be as stealthy as possible, you know? I guess, from this point on, we're gonna have to go across houses and Test our luck. Mild zombie spawn. Which is ideal. In here we've got some canned tuna. Um, what is our information? Burger flipper. Hell yeah. Former scout. Handy. 
cat eyes zombies killed zero our strength is amazing maintenance is okay cooking is okay foraging is good carpentry is okay i wonder if we have weapons available available for us I'm gonna start grabbing. Uh oh. Did he see us? Closed it. <laughs> dish, to dish towel. Griddle pan and rolling pin. I'm gonna get the pan and just have this as our primary equipment. Good thing we have uh Is there only one door into this house? Okay, well, let's unlock it. How do I unlock? And let's uh scout. I hear a bunch of zombies, dude. Whoa, 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 whoa. There's a second one right behind me? That was close. Good thing I had perception. I was wondering where that noise was coming from. Boxers. Socks and tees. What about the other zombie? What do you have, sir? Socks and boxers, baggy jeans. All right, then. This is my backyard, huh? Interesting. Anything here? Nothing here. Well, so far, so good. We need to find a watch. And this is our home. There's a house over there that we can go to. Or we can go across the street to that double-decker house. I don't want to jump this fence. It's too risky, so... You know, I've, I've seen... I've seen enough death... To know... <laughs> where that's coming from. All right, he sees us. So we can we can actually hear them coming, huh? I wonder if the other guy sees us too. Interesting. Zombie? Okay, that guy moved. There's a couple more. I think we should just clear this area. How do I push? Space bar. Okay. Okay. I got to find I got to figure that out cuz one mistake in swinging and we miss could cost our life. So it's a good thing that we kind of figured it out. What the? Where'd you come from? Okay. Oh boy. Well, please tell me that's it for the rest of the the entire area, right? Because that guy came out of nowhere. I'm not sure how many of you guys enjoy long format videos like this. But it's worth a shot. I mean, it is a diary after all. You guys get to see how I died, how I lived. So, let me just keep it rolling like this. 
We've officially made it across the street. Checking to see if this has anything. Nothing. First rule of entering premises like this is to check the doors and the windows. Sometimes there's alarms in, in these houses. And of course, we're gonna double check to see if there's any zombies around. There's one. This is their laundry room. Kitchen. So far so good. I hear a window. It might be this guy. It could either be this guy or one inside the building. Good thing this guy is just weak. Dope. We survived. Okay, I guess we uh come in from this area. So, I guess once that fails, that's it, right? That is locked as well. After a couple of tries, we made it. Booyah. Nothing, nothing, okay. Well, as a burger flipper, we are uh, in need of food, tea bag. We have a radio in here, can we pick this up? Nothing. Got bread knife, spoon plate, canned beans, spaghetti. Can we eat any of our stuff? Let's feed our let's feed our uh, character. Good. And then let's put the uh, empty can in here. My crave has anything? It doesn't have anything. Okay, let's keep exploring the whole room. I don't know why I lingered there for too long. Second floor might not be clear, but it's best if we clear this first. Empty room, huh? What would you guys do if you guys got stuck in that little room and zombies are just outside of the door? I'd starve to death, starve to death. Wasn't here. Auto manual commercial skill book, sheet of paper. Wait, why did I clip it into my primary? Okay, I will keep this. And I'm gonna remove curtains over here. I'll keep it for myself, you know what I'm saying? Still don't know what time of day it is. Let's go back to the kitchen, I guess. We might have to spend the rest of the night here. Um, adhesive bandages. I'm going to have to grab this. Hairspray. Plunger. I'm gonna close the curtains over here. There you go. Gonna have, we're, we won't have any vision. 
Okay. All right. There's just an empty T-shirt in the area for some reason. Your buds and a gun case. Whoa. Okay. So now, I'm facing a dilemma. We are point one three over. This is point eight, point eight. I guess I'm gonna have to drink, huh? Can we drink? Hello? Put container in the drawer. Why? So maybe it's because I have it opened somewhere, but what if we move away from it? Disable auto drink. Enable auto drink. What? I am so confused. Oh, we could put it in our back. Okay, we can't do this. I guess I'll eat the beans, huh? Okay, these guys I can't eat. Just gonna have to keep going. Headphones, point two. What about your buds? Point one. Leather jacket. We do have a leather jacket on, I think. And this is a dead end. Can we rip these into rags? Formal t-shirt, pants. Okay, well, nothing fancy in here. Keep moving. There's a bunch of fancy stuff in here too. Sheet. Bath towel. Adhesive bandages. 0.05. Grab it. It looks like it's getting kind of dark outside too. Anything in here? Backpack? Dog food and a rubber do duck. Another room in here. Well, it doesn't look like there's anything infested, which is good. Alarm clock. And a tissue. This is for first aid. We can grab the pen in here. Had to open the map and I think because we have a pen need pencil we'll uh wait ah there you go can we reduce the size of the writing hello Remove all annotations and forget my knowledge. Interesting. Okay. Well, fairly heavy, carrying a little too much. Griddle pan is our favorite equipment. Great. Um, is there? Oh God, zombie! Did he hear us? Looks to me like they're migrating somewhere, bro. Well, we've cleared this house. And I think we can, uh, we can afford to drink at least. Right? There's vitamins. Oh, if you right click on it. 
There's vitamins. 0.41. We need to draw something. Hmm. Do we want to keep the belt on? What is this? Getting bored. God damn it. Gonna have to fight them. Find me. What the fuck? Oh. We found an alarm. Watch. And this guy was holding a newspaper. What the fuck? Oh, another zombie. I guess that's dangerous. We gotta close this. So, black digital alarm. Okay, alarm is disabled. It's 5.30. We're chilling still. Tomato fresh. Want to eat this? Of course we do. Wait, it didn't do anything. It just went into our, <laughs> it just went into our thing. Canned beans, mushroom soup. Can't really do much about this until we get a can opener. So there's no point holding on to it. We just gotta lower our. We just need to lower our. Uh, Encumbrance. Well, okay. There's so many of them. There's so many of them in their area. I guess that's it, right? For our uh, clearing purposes. Leather jacket. Silver bangle. No, I'm not going to carry that. At least we... Uh... Oh my god, there's so many of them over there. That is not cool. they see us I'd be fuming if they saw us bro so this is the problem with short-sightedness we we do have a problem <laughs>
wonder if they're gonna try to come to us. That's the issue. Do we wanna... Put in container, cupboard. No, we don't wanna do this. How do we open a gun case? Do you guys know? Because I have no clue. Do we equip primary? And then what do we do? So I think we have to um, put it on the floor, I guess. I'm just guessing here. Oh, that's right. We put it on the floor and then we take it. Ammo count empty. No bullets. Okay, so what if we open box and then we insert eight bullets in the magazine? That's cool. And then we great. Now we have a gun. We're lethal. Where did the gun go? Can we not put it in the belt? We're not allowed to put it in the belt. Interesting. So, the pistol is how much weight? 2.2. .2. The bag is how much weight? The gun case is 0.5. Ah. So can we put the gun case down and then put like books on it? Oh yeah, we can. Of course we can. <laughs> so, well, I, I think we're gonna carry the gun case and put like stuff in it. Uh, sheets. And all that good stuff. And then I think we can equip it to the secondary. Can we fight? Yeah, we can. Interesting. So now it's like seven o'clock, right? I guess at this time we can um, go to the bookshelf downstairs and start educating ourselves. Just double checking outside. We can't see clearly, so we don't wanna We don't want to fuck ourselves over. It's a shame I removed all the curtains over there. They could have, I could have sworn I did. They will see us. Okay, we got a sheet of paper. Um, let's take a look at this and put it in here. Can we read? Skill level too low to read. Foraging level two. Okay, that's fair. That is fair. Okay. Can't do much with that. Can we uh somehow? drink huh okay we can't really do much at this point right unless we want to run to the other side we don't have a lot of, to work with um, I think our next target would be uh that house over there i can already see one zombie two there's like a f bunch of them just chilling but uh <laughs> by the fence so that's three towards that direction what is that north i don't have any um guide 
I don't know where north is, so we are going to need a compass for it. So double checking here. Ooh, that is a lot of zombies. It's a big house though, this one. I guess that's where the horde went. Headphones and leather jacket. Hmm. Stones rare. Uh, so we can kind of do investigation. Well, okay. I guess we're going to call it a night here. Sleep, right? I know we're kind of moving a little slow but uh comes with the turf we are we are kind of new point two i think what we can do in this case is drop it on the floor for a second and uh what i'm gonna do is actually try to reload my gun you know um So let's do unequip, or wait, unequip, and then equip, inject magazine, huh, rack. Does that work? Any of our skills? Reloading. Hmm. I wonder how. Um, unload. Okay, great. And then what? Insert. Okay, well. I guess at this point, we can only entertain ourselves with with this. <laughs> this is going to be the rest of the night, ladies and gentlemen. My character feels lonely now, I think. He does feel bored. He's getting bored just putting rounds into his magazine. But it is the way it is, my guy. We need to learn. We need to up our skills in reloading. Otherwise, when it comes down to it, we're going to start fumbling. We, that's the one thing that we don't want to happen is when... Shit hits the fan. We drop our mags. Worst case scenario, we drop our bullets. And that'll be the death of us. I wonder if the zombies' um, perception levels can hear can hear us um, from this far. Reloading is almost going to level up. Can you also let me know in the comments if exercising before sleeping is better than exercising after sleeping? Because I'm worried about the fatigue levels hitting us. Like out of nowhere. That would be the worst case scenario.
Come on now, level up. I hear zombies. Literally just outside of our building. My guy's getting hungry too. You fat ass. Nice. Oh, we can attach it to our back. Cool. All right then, we shall go to sleep. Actually, can I work out? Is it possible? I can exercise, let's do sit-ups. Sit-ups for 20 minutes. This is gonna improve our core muscles, if I'm not mistaken. And after 20 minutes of sit-ups, that's wild. 20 minutes of sit-ups, even in real life. I can feel my fatigue building. Ooh. Unpleasantly hot. Well, bear with it. What is this? Drowsy. What is this? Take a break. All right, congratulations. Maybe I should uh, remove my leather jacket. Maybe I should uh, drink. I'm gonna go ahead and wash myself. Damn, at 12 o'clock, my character feels really tired, huh? Okay, we're learning a little bit about, more about ourselves. Where did it go? Maybe we should chill downstairs closer to radio. Wait, is that it? Just romance and stuff? Well, I guess we can call it a day, huh? Are you sure you want to sleep? Yes, I do. We wake up pretty early, 7.30. And, uh... We'll continue with day two tomorrow. See you guys later. Peace.